on Stupid So This Battle is from Boo's perspective, and that is me right there. Okay? Good. So yeah, I have a battle against Boo. I sent out my Cyclops, and she sent out her Zing Mazong, whatever that means. I go straight for the overheat because, uh, you know, it's a steel type and it should get wrecked, right? No, incorrect, because she has a freaking heat proof bronze on, which is fucking incredibly uncommon these days. And it actually survives my overheat despite uh, all the, uh, yeah. So I send out my Gengar after she sets up Stealth because I'm expecting the earthquake and I thought I could bring in my Gengar for free. And uh, I'm gonna go for the substitute now, expecting her to switch out, but she stays and goes for the gyro ball. So I'm going to have to kill her freaking Zing Mazong with a Shadow Ball. <laughs> Yes, I go for the Shadow Ball and it dies. So, bad start for me, pretty much, because he, uh, she got her Stealth Rock up still. She's gonna go to her freaking Jirachi, and I'm gonna switch straight back to my Cyclops. Uh, I don't know why his name is Cyclops, because it definitely has two eyes. But, um, she goes for the Ice Punch, doesn't do anything. Luckily, I don't get frozen. She goes to her, uh, fucking Gyarados, and I go for the Overheat. And if you know what a Specs Heat Train is capable of, you would not be surprised at how much damage this does. That's more than half, but I'm going to be forced to switch out anyway, so I go straight to my Suicune. And I play so badly here. Um, she's going to go for the Waterfall, it's not going to do anything, obviously. Um, I expected her to switch out, so I, I'm actually going to go for the Calm Mind. And, um, yeah. Once I, know, once I knew that she knew that I was faster than her uh, Gyarados, I really should have expected her to switch out. She goes for the Earthquake, and she's going to switch into her Shaman next turn. So I, I knew I was really going to click from the Ice Beam, but I don't want to make excuses. I played bad. I went for the Hidden Power Electric, fully knowing that she was going to switch into a Pokemon that resisted uh, Electric-type moves. And um, she switches into fucking Sonic, the Hedgehog, and she's going to go for the Spec C Flare, so I'm definitely going to die from that. And another thing, this whole entire battle, I thought this freaking Shaman was Scarfed. It makes no sense why I thought that. I really don't know why I did. Uh, I'm going to set up my Celebi now. She's gonna go into a Dust Noir, which fucking sucks. I don't know why she's using Dust Noir, but I guess it worked for her. Um, I'm gonna switch out after paralyzing it, and I'm gonna go to my uh, Swampert. And she's gonna go for the Earthquake, and a random iTunes pop up popped up right there. And uh, since my Swampert's more uh, specially defensive, that Earthquake actually did more than I thought it would. I go for the Stealth Rock, she gets paralyzed. I'm gonna switch right back out to Celebi because I don't want to get burned or anything. Uh, she gets paralyzed again. I'm going to go for the Thunder Wave again, expecting her to switch out, but she doesn't switch out. She goes for the Shadow Steam now. I'm just going to go for the uh, Leaf Storm now because Leaf Storm's fucking powerful. Um, but it's not going to be quite enough to kill, and now I have to go for the Recover because I don't want to die, and I don't want to stay in and go for another Leaf Storm because it really I don't think it'll do anything. But she predicts my... Uh, predicts my my recover and goes for the pain split and I'm going to have to surrender haha <laughs> joking that was so horrible anyway I'm gonna go for a recover again uh, she's gonna go for the earthquake expecting my heat train to come in and I was half ex I was half going to bring my heat train in because I think a specs over here will be able to kill this uh, thingy but now I'm gonna bring in my Cyclops because I don't think that she would use earthquake again uh, she brings in a Jolteon though, so she's just using Pokemon that I would never use because they all suck in my opinion, but she's still wrecking me, so that just shows how good she is. <laughs> uh, she goes for a Thunderbolt, which I believe was, was uh, either life or respect, so I was paying attention. I survive and go for the overheat and get the kill. She brings out her Sonic, I'm going to stay in just to die, I guess. Just kidding. I'm going to go to my Gengar expecting a uh, Earth Power, but she's smart and she goes for the Air Slide, so that was a good move on her part. Uh, I'm going to bring in my Jirachi, I'm going to go for the Fire Punch, because, uh, no, I'm not going to go for the, yeah, I, I do go for the Fire Punch, damn. <laughs> so that was like a week or two ago, not really sure. Um, so I go for the Fire Punch, it does half to the Jirachi, she's going to U-turn out and go to her I Surrender. Uh, fire Punch is not going to do jack diddly to that thing, um, but since it's paralyzed, I'm, I should be able to get a lot of flinches with Iron Head. Um, yeah, I get the first flinch. Uh, don't get the second flinch, unfortunately. But um, the earthquake is not going to do as much as I thought it would do, but it's still going to do quite a bit. Uh, but I can just take him out with one more 
uh, Iron Head after the Shadow Sneak. So the Shadow Sneak plus the Earthquake actually did quite a bit, but that's okay. I'm gonna take him out with the Iron Head. She's gonna go back to her Jirachi. I'm gonna switch out because I need to save my Jirachi for later. And I'm gonna go to my Cyclops, and after Stealth Rock, a U turn will be able to kill my Heatran. Uh, so, she's gonna send out her freaking Shaman, which pissed me off. Fuck. And this is exactly why it pissed me off. She's gonna go for the Seed Flare, but I'm gonna go for Protect just to scout out the move. I don't really have anything to switch into because all my Pokemon are on low health, except for Celebi, which can't. Uh, hit the shaman for any super effective attacks so I'm gonna stay in and let my swampert die which was probably a bad mistake now that I look back on it but it's okay I set up my Celebi now uh, she misses the sea flare I go for the leaf storm and uh, because I thought this um, shaman was scarfed and not specs I'm gonna go for the recover but after seeing how much damage the seed flare does I can assume that it's specs and she gets a special defense trap. So if I had gone for a Leaf Storm there, I could have had a chance to win. But since I went for the recover, another sea floor is actually going to be enough to kill me. So, shit. That's where I fucked up. And another thing I fucked up on is that I just found out that this Shaman is not scarfed. <laughs> so I kill it with a Fire Punch. And um, she's going to bring out her own Jirachi to kill me. So good game, boo. Everybody subscribe here, the ghostly friend, and deuces.